What's going on guys? Welcome back to Arcway, a new direction of modern man. In today's video, I'm gonna show you guys how to dress like Timothy Chalamet. You guys have been requesting many people, so hold your horses, I'm gonna get to it. So I'm gonna share with you guys three characteristics that you guys can pick up from his style, so you guys can adapt it into your own style and enhance your style to the next level, man. Cause you know what it's all about, it's all about levels, man. Levels, man. Let's go, man. All right, guys, if you guys are new to this channel, let me know. Put in the comment section down below. Also, subscribe down to the channel down below, right over there. And also, give this video a big thumbs up. More people see it. At the same time, the content grows. So let's let's make it grow a little bit, right? So when it comes down to breaking down his outfits, first thing I want to talk to you guys is about monochrome outfits. So you want to get monochrome outfits, meaning an outfit that states within one color. It could be a little bit shaded a little differently, but mostly one color. If it's going to be blue, it's all blue so the first outfit he's wearing is a monochrome suit it's a corduroy it states the great thing about this outfit is that he complements it with the white as well so anytime you do have a base color you want to complement it with a color that stands out so it creates some contrast and it just creates a different look within the piece or just makes it look all together so you can see how he did it with his white pair of shoes and it also with his white shirt so let's go on to the next one so this one's a little more dressed up, a little more formal, a little more edgier, a little more rock starish. So this is like a loose fitting suit, monochromatic yet again. This is actually quite different from anything I've seen. Not many people wear this strong of a color, especially in North America. Some people you'll see like MGK, which I did a video on before. Um, maybe like Kid Cudi as well. Um, so, but at the same time, this is actually very punk rockish nice edge definitely definitely for a semi-formal event definitely red carpet great compliment with the boots also yeah, i like how the pants aren't hemmed they just kind of have that nice drape over the shoe it looks like it's at a preset size usually it could come in like a short size but all, all in all man this outfit's pretty fire the whole look of it is pretty relaxed obviously the color is very strong with this outfit and it gets its presence that it demands so from head to toe, this outfit's pretty fire. Electric blue monochromatic, yet again. You got the long sleeve shirt. You got the loose end pants. They add to the mobility, comfortability as well. At the same time, you got the boots, the nice Chelsea's. And this type of thing is, this type of outfit is actually a nice look because with the boots, it makes everything stand out. At the same time, it adds that contrast. So next thing on my list is stepping outside your comfort zone, being able to be edgy, being able to be different. I think that's a really important key when it comes down to someone's personality and their style, but also putting yourself out there a little bit more differently. I just think that's the key essential when it comes down to fashion and style as a person at the same time as you develop into who you want to become. So first thing I want to look at here with Timothy's style is that he has a white base t-shirt and then he has these striped pirate looking pants and these pants are actually pretty fire because wait wait for it wait for it wait for it because you don't see modern day pirates that's it you don't see modern day pirates at all at the same time this is one in the flesh right here this is something that you guys can pick up off of yet again check how he's wearing the boots i told you guys this before sometimes you don't even need to wear sneakers all the time you just have to wear boots i said this in many videos before start wearing boots start wearing chelsea's you look more formal at the same time you look more mature so you can see how this whole outfit looks on him at the same time he got this nice necklace it looks like a 30 inch chain also you got the glasses you got some bracelets on his wrist there let me just show you something here look at the details of his pants look how the feathers frail on the end of it this is a little bit different this is edgy this is a step in outside your comfort zone look into stores that offer something completely different look into cause cos they always offer something a little more different than your average but also look into urban outfitters urban outfitters is kind of more on the hipster end but at the same time there's some stuff i'll wear so check those places out you can always find something so this outfit right here is a louis vuitton it's a hoodie and it has about 3,000 crystals um crystal plated so yeah this outfit is is powerful man this is what i'm talking about when it comes down to wearing something that's different than the rest so you're in all black and you're wearing crystal hoodie by louis vuitton at the same time you're wearing your favorite boots on a red carpet what's better than that this guy is 25 but he's dressing like a designer man so this is impressive man this is a great look 
So next thing I want to talk to you guys about is very, very mandatory. And I told you guys before that every man should have this in his wardrobe. And that is a nice tailored suit. And so let's look at some style inspirations that Timothy's wearing. So maybe you guys can get into more suits at the same time. You guys can get some inspirations on how to wear suits. All right, so first look Timothy has is an all black suit with a pop of color. Like I said before, guys, having that color, having that contrast is key. It looks like a really nice yellow. I think I have something like that in my closet. But yeah, it has a nice yellow pop right there with the black suit. Yet again, guys, he's wearing the boots. So like, let's just say that's his signature and nothing better than that, man. Simple, clean, professional, at the same time, casual. So the next look is quite dapper. It is a nice tailored suit. So this outfit is very simple. At the same time, it's a double-breasted suit. Um, and then also he has a cropped pair of pants with the boots. So look at this, look at this, this is phenomenal. So he has a white pocket square accenting the shirt and the details of the buttons are brown and that is complementing his boots. So all together, this whole outfit is pretty phenomenal, pretty nice, it's pretty simple, it's pretty clean. So one thing I mentioned to you guys about before is that it's all about the tailoring. You wanna get a good tailor that knows your body at the same time, uh, they wanna emphasize your key points, your, your key features. That's what it's all about, emphasizing the key features of your body so they can make you the best version of yourself through clothing. So this next outfit is gonna be a mix of his other styles into one. So you got the monochrome at the same time the suits. So into one, boom, you got this. So this is actually a nice suit at the same time. It's the, the whole message of it is, is amazing. So this outfit is by Alexander McQueen and this outfit is powerful. It's a statement at the same time. You got the rose, you got the rose redded flowers on the red carpet, complimenting the black boots and he's not wearing a shirt. As you start seeing with his outfits, he doesn't really wear his shirts with his outfits. Those nice long sleeve white shirts with the cuffs. He kind of opts out for black t-shirts, white t-shirts, v-necks, scoop necks. And that's something maybe he's doing or maybe it's the generation that's coming up that they prefer to do that. But it's nice complimentary to what he's wearing. At the same time, it has a nice look. Hands down, I actually think this is the best dressed dude that I actually styled broke down in a while because I haven't really seen a lot of young cats dressing like this, dressing so professional at the same time, defining a style within what they like and really sticking to it. So compliments to Timothy because this is uh because this style is amazing. I like his style, I like his personality. Look for inspirations in any of these type of videos that I do post, looking to see what they wear and how they wear it, and if you can resonate off those looks. So if you guys found any content that you guys like from this channel, make sure to let me know in the comment section down below. Also subscribe down to the channel, subscribe down to the channel, make sure you guys do that hit the thumbs up on this video so more people see it at the same time if you guys like any of the content just let me know let me know if you guys want me to style break down anyone else you guys may think of celebrities rock stars public figures doesn't matter yet again my name is Tulu, and i'll see you guys in the next video peace